Hey, what's up everyone? In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys what I use, what cleaning products I use to uh, wash my vehicle after someone drops it off. And um, I'm the car came back actually pretty clean, uh, very gently used. So I just use my kind of my everyday products. That's all I'm gonna use today. Uh, if it needs more deeper cleaning, there's other stuff that I use. Uh, for example, I use a, a tire and wheel cleaner from McGuire's that works pretty well. But today I'm gonna show you just stuff that I use, whether it's, when it comes back fairly clean and uh, what I use personally for my own personal vehicle that I use sort of every time I wash it. Again, as long as it's not too dirty. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I use. So both my vehicles have leather seats both BMWs. So what I like to use in between trips is this one. Um, it, it actually, once uh, someone smoked in my vehicle and I could smell the smoke in my leather. So I tried this one out and really it, it did remove the leather, the, the smoke smell from the leather. So I just kind of stuck with it and um, use it to just clean, deodorize my seats. Uh, after every trip and then for the interior right now I'm using this one and the thing I like about this one is it's safe on screens as you can see right there which both my cars have and it actually smells pretty good it, it smells very fresh and I think it has a scent here um, I don't see it now but I think it has like an actual scent um, so it's a nice oh there it is clean fresh clean fresh sun so yeah I like it it does a good job cleaning and also it smells good and then for my uh, windows I use this one here invisible glass does a good job no streaks uh, safe on tints with, which uh, one of my cars currently has tints um, this one the white one that I'm washing now my convertible does not yet although I'm gonna put some tints on that pretty soon so that that's what I use for my windows and then after I, uh, once I run it through the wash, as I'm drying it, I'm just gonna spray this. Uh, just from AutoZone, it's just a generic brand, it's five bucks. It does the job, uh, it's good. It actually helps get rid of uh, watermarks, water stains as I'm drying it. And just kind of gives it a nice, almost like a hand wash feel. So that's what I use to, uh, when I uh, wipe down the vehicle. I just ran it through the wash. It's actually already pretty dry, but I'm still gonna use this to uh, just clean it, just to get rid of some watermarks and stuff like that. All right, so with this uh, leather cleaner, which I'm gonna use first, uh, this lady, it, it doesn't look like she, no one sat in the vehicle, just herself, because the passenger side is clean and the back seat's like clean, uh, just like when I gave it to her. So, but just in case, I'm gonna, spray down the driver's seat and the passenger seat and I was also uh, spray down this area just to kind of keep it fresh so I'm not gonna worry about the back seat it really doesn't look like anyone sat back there because my rubber floor mats that I have back there not only are they clean but usually when someone sits there they kind of push back a little bit they're pretty perfect so uh, I'm just gonna spray this change the spray one second there we go so I'll just spray it the headrest too I mean part of the reason why I do this leather cleaner is just for me when I sit in the car I just feel more comfortable having it all wiped down deodorized and all that so does a good job there uh, it does have a scent the leather cleaner but it actually goes away pretty quickly I mean it, it's like a clean scent like a fresh scent uh, I'm not a huge fan of the way it smells I mean it's all right but um, it does go away like it'll go away after like I don't know maybe it'll be gone pretty soon it doesn't stay there uh, the smell doesn't stay there long 
So I got the driver's side clean. I'm going to go on the other side. All right. So of course, same deal here. Spray it, spray the headrest and wipe it down. And then I'm using a microfiber towel that they actually have here at the car wash. Um, I do have my own, these orange ones that I use, but I figure, you know, just use these. These look pretty clean to uh, use on the seats. These cracks. Cool. And then I'll show you guys the back. The back's clean. Uh -huh. Floor mats, everything looks good. But what I'm going to do here is I'm going to just wipe it. I'm not going to spray it. I'm just going to wipe it down a little bit. I mean, there's some solution on the uh, towel for me spraying the front. I'm just going to wipe it down a little bit and do the same on the other side. Just a quick wipe down. Actually, it looks like uh, she have spilled something here. I'm going to spray it actually. I'm going to spray this side. No big deal. Just uh, you know, she did have some stuff back here. That's probably what it's from. I haven't vacuumed it yet, I'm gonna vacuum just to get the seats clean a little bit. But I wanted to wipe it down first. So that's the inside. Let me actually do this here. Headrest. Yeah, so as you can see, I mean the floor mats are clean. They're not they haven't moved, so it doesn't look like anyone sat here. I don't see any any dirt here so we're going to get shape back here so i'm just going to do the front the dashboard and that should take care of it uh i also do wipe down the floor mat as you can see it's uh it's kind of yucky i mean it is a floor mat but i wipe it down um actually when i do the here i can wipe i'll just wipe it down with this same cloth that i used although i'm going to vacuum first all right so i vacuumed it and I'm just gonna wipe it down here. And it'll look pretty good. The towel's a little wet from, uh, I guess when the car wash, when they wash these things. So I like it cause it's a little damp. And uh, plus with uh, what I sprayed here, even though it's a leather cleaner, it cleaned it pretty well. I think it looks better in picture than it does on camera or better in person than it does on camera but as you can see it's a noticeable difference um, wiping that down too all right and then with this i did wipe it down with uh clorox wipes so i wiped it all down but i'm gonna use the spray that i showed you a little bit of uh, coffee or something over there cup holders so I'm pretty detailed when I wash it. Um, you know, these little things, uh, they do bother me a little bit. So I'm gonna clean it up, um, spray this on the dash here. Uh, actually, I'll spray, sorry for the shaking. Yeah, so it's safe to spray on, uh, you know, screens like that. I just spray it all around and close this so I can get that. And then just for good measure, I'll spray this again just so it kind of get everything there all right so i'm gonna wipe it down here and i'll show you the result all right so i cleaned it up there like that well let's see here did i get that good yeah you can see the cup holders got those Got the dash all clean, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, also spray like see the door that bothers me. I'm gonna wipe that down. And then 
I'm gonna spray this here. Wipe it down. Okay. Uh, let's check this side. Yeah, I'm not trying to do anything here. I'll just wipe it down a little bit. back here but you know, I'll just wipe it down a little bit and then put the front door yeah definitely pay attention to the little trim there because the uh, fingerprints and stuff it picks it up pretty well so make sure I wipe it all down and then this side doesn't look like anyone sat here I'm still gonna just wipe it down. All right, so that's the inside. So I'm just gonna quickly uh, vacuum a little bit here, just to make sure it's super clean. And then uh, I'm gonna show you guys when I uh, when I spray that uh, wax for the outside. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and spray this here. I actually had a uh, bought a new one. Not too, I think I used it once or twice and I believe I must have forgot it here at the car wash. So I have to go buy another one. Uh, luckily it's only five bucks. But uh, yeah, this car goes, so today's Tuesday. This car does go out on Thursday. So it's Tuesday night. So it goes out uh, Thursday at 5 p.m. So I'm probably not gonna, I'm actually not gonna drive it. Just to, so I don't have to touch it up later. You know, even if it's clean, if I drove it for a couple days, I'll still wash it, um, even though <laughs> it looks clean. But yeah, just to avoid it, since I already have a booking for Thursday, I'm just not gonna drive it all. Take it home, put it in the garage. So yeah, I'm just gonna spray it all down real quick. Quick thing, one thing that I always like to do is I like to wipe this part down because Otherwise, when you drive off, it just, a bunch of water starts dripping and then you, next thing you know, you got some water uh, spots there. So I always wipe this all down, wipe it down well, so to avoid all that. 